In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a portfolio style grid of images on your home page, representing the different types of work you do. To receive notifications about new tutorials and our weekly live stream, be sure to click the subscribe button. One option for displaying a grid on your home page is to have multiple galleries show with various genres of photography you offer as a service. In my example here, I have several galleries in a portfolio group. Each gallery has the cover thumbnail I want representing the gallery applied, and these images are what will show on the homepage. Once you have this group all set up and ready to go, you can then link it to the homepage by starting in the dashboard, going to Website, and going to Customize Website. If you're not already using a grid layout, you'll want to make sure to change over to one. This can be done by going to Layout in the upper left corner. The two grid layouts are available at the very top. Once a grid layout is applied, you'll want to go to Grid Content at the top and click the orange Select button. Here I'll choose the group I created. After linking to the group, I'm going to choose Open Page below it. This is important. Now when I click on one of these galleries, it is going to take me straight to the Thumbnails page. This is ideal because no matter what gallery I click on, it will take me to the Thumbnails page, whether a price list is applied to the gallery or not. This can be good for consistency's sake when a person is trying to view several of the portfolio galleries at once. Once you've got everything linked properly, you're ready to custom tailor the look of your homepage. You'll want to click Grid Options at the top of the page. There are many items you can edit in this area by clicking the other tabs, but for now we'll focus on what you can do with this grid. Here you can play around with the grid style by choosing either A, B, or C. Then you can test out the minimum row height. The smaller this number is, the smaller the items will show. You can also add some spacing between and around the cells using the remaining tools. Be sure to apply your changes and take a look in preview mode. You may also want to check out the thumbnails tab. I like to set my grid items up so that the title doesn't display just when the item is hovered over, but so that it will display at all times. So for text and button placement, I usually choose Inside Photo Map below Photo and then make sure the title is set to show. So there you have it. In review, you can set up a group with multiple galleries inside of it that will act as your portfolio and add it as grid content to your homepage. This grid can be highly customized by changing the image size and spacing as well as how the title is displayed to your site visitors. This is Kayla with Zenfolio Customer Support. Thank you for watching and good luck with adding a portfolio grid to your homepage.